Crews are still on the scene tonight of a deadly crash that claimed two lives near the Davidson County Williamson County line. Yeah, we know a T-Dot truck was one of the vehicles involved. Let's go to News Channel 5's Jason Lamb. He's out Long Nolansville Pike with the latest on just what happened. Jason. Yeah, that's right. And breaking news in just the last three minutes, police have now started letting one lane of traffic go through here on the southbound lanes of Nolansville Pike. That is just happening with the last few minutes or so. This is a crash involving two vehicles, including a T-Dot truck with two workers in it. Let's go to some uh, some video that we shot earlier as we tell you just some of the details of how this crash happened. Metro police say this was a crash involving two vehicles, one a Nissan Sentra with one person in it, okay. the other a T-Dot truck with two T-Dot workers in it. They apparently both crashed somewhere here south of Old Hickory Boulevard on Nolansville Pike. That crash killed the person that was in the uh, Nissan Sentra and it injured the two T-Dot workers that were in that white T-Dot truck. But we are told those injuries on the T-Dot workers are minor. But cleanup continues here as a tow trucks continue to arrive to clear up the scene. But again, traffic is now back open to one lane going southbound here on Nolansville Pike. Both northbound lanes are still closed.